from Krimer Media in Johannesburg, this is the Real Economy Report. Local hydraulic pump supplier Varna South Africa Pumps and Equipment has upgraded its on-site facilities to allow for better quality control, more environment-friendly manufacturing and faster assembly of its hydraulic pump trucks. Halima Frost has the details. Werner South Africa has undertaken to expand its on-site facilities to cope with the demand for its truck-mounted high-pressure pump and jetting units. The upgrades have allowed the company to increase its turnaround time from four to six months to as little as two to three months, depending on the truck or trailer-mounted unit ordered. Werner Pumps MD Sebastian Werner explains what upgrades have been made to the facility. So we've done various uh, expansions. We've increased or we've built uh, a facility for our electronics, uh, which we basically produce in-house. Um, we've also done a paint booth, which is uh, a recent sort of upgrade to our painting facility. Um, we've also done an increase or uh, uh, improvement to our hydraulic um, section where we build all the hydraulics uh, on, on our equipment in-house instead of buying from a third party. So those are the small aspects that we've done to make our business more efficient. The upgrades also include two under-roof welding booths, one of which houses a new tank welding rotator, which allows the tank to be easily and smoothly rotated while the welder works. Werner suggests that the quality and uniformity of the weld has been more evident since this addition. Werner tells Engineering News that the need to upgrade came with being ISO accredited, which prompted the company to improve its standards and efficacy, with an even further push to improve the company's environmental ratings. Werner also suggests that the company not only looked at its own environmental impact, but also that of the product it supplies to its clients. We've got various orders. We've got uh, from trailer mounted units all the way up to vacuum uh, combination jetting units, as well as uh, water recycling or Amanzi recycling units. They are mainly for contractors, but uh, for municipal application and for ESCOM, so power generating um, companies. Werner also highlights that being 100% locally assembled allows for job creation and helps boost local manufacture and also helps the company offer better prices and most importantly quality. So the core of our business is 100% SA built, meaning that uh, we want to be able to supply 100% locally South African built equipment for the African and South African market. And um, the, the reason why we've done it is to, first of all, help the South African economy because uh, jobs are required in this country. The European imports are perceived to be of a higher quality, which um, we've, we've uh, counteracted by implementing our ISO and um, that's helped us improve our quality. And uh, our product is of higher quality because we use better components and um, com compared to European uh, standard we've actually uh, managed to produce a better product. That's Cream Media's Real Economy Report. Join us again next week for more news and insights into South Africa's real economy. And don't forget to listen to the audio version of our engineering news daily email newsletter.